Hey, what's happening, everyone? I'm Sir James coming at you guys with another video, and today I have yet another custom kyber crystal. You guys have been really enjoying these videos, and I've been enjoying collecting these custom crystals because it adds to my current already collection from Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. Now, this one here is the Elemental Nature Crystal, which if you already get the reference, this is themed for the Sabi's Workshop lightsabers. And in fact, there's gonna be a crystal for each of the different theme sets. And what's really cool too, for anyone that may have kind of missed out on the previous crystals, like the Dark Side, the Ben Solo, or the Skywalker crystal, since those were limited edition, the Sabi themed crystals are not meaning that these are gonna be much more available for you guys. In fact, here's my card that has no number on it. However, it does have its own personal backstory, which I wish to read right now, that I give you guys a closer look at the crystal before we test it out, make sure it's fully functional. So here we go. On the big bold letters, we have Elemental Crystal, and it says, representing the natural themes of balance and harmony, these crystals are found in the mountain range of a forgotten planet in the distant realm. A planet that has remained peaceful and has seen none of the war that has ranged in the galaxy. This allows for the true connection of the force, with the one side representing pure white, balance of the force, and the other green elemental nature of the forest greatest teachers. So I think that's a really cool description and I really enjoy these backstories of these custom crystals. Let me know what you guys think about that one in the description below, or I should say the comment section below. So here is a closer look at the custom crystal here. As you can see, we have a uh, good amount of white there with a bit of uh, green. Really like how these turn out. And if you guys recall, I mentioned, you know, how it would be kind of a cool idea to have like a kyber crystal, kind of like candy, you know, maybe rock candy, gummy snack. Or if someone were to create, maybe it's available, I just haven't looked yet, a jello mold for crystals and just make jello related kyber crystals. I think that would be delicious. So let's go ahead and put this into a lightsaber. So we should have, again, two different colors depending on the orientation of the crystal. And based on how the other ones were done, uh, I'm assuming that if we put green on the bottom, we should get green first. Go ahead and put it in here. Okay, it's registering as green. Go ahead and insert a blade. And then our switch. And here we go in three, two, one. And boom, there is our green. As always, these crystals do not add anything new. They're using the same kind of information that Disney would use and the kyber crystals that they offer. So meaning that the Savi Saber, electronic wise, sound wise, exactly the same, no difference whatsoever. But again, the one side we do have our green blade as advertised. Next, if we simply take the same crystal, and all we're gonna do is flip it upside down if you've never seen any of these videos already. All right, try to angle this one. There we go. It is registering as white. I remember uh, watching uh, Dano channel. He had a video where he put a white crystal in and his blade lit up yellow for whatever reason. I think it had a bad chassis. So let's see if mine's a bad chassis or will it go white. Boom, there we go. We got our white blade. I really like the sound of this one, by the way. So yeah. Love that sound. Let's go ahead and remove our crystal now. Put these here back. Next, we're gonna go ahead and bring on over the holocrons because it wouldn't be a complete video unless if we put them in here to see what voices we get. Now we're gonna go ahead and start with the Sith Holocron first. Uh, now do keep in mind, uh, just in case if you've never seen the crystals from Galaxy's Edge or my last video, anytime you would put a Jedi related crystal, doesn't matter what color, you're going to get the same exact voice, which is Palpatine himself. Uh, since we've already heard all the dialogue for Palpatine, I'm only going to, um, uh, 
basically allowed us to play twice depending on which dialogue we get. Just so you guys can know that if you have a Sith Holocron and you were to put a Jedi related crystal in here, this is what you're going to be getting. So let's go ahead and turn this on. Put green down. As you can see, we have our green lighting there. And again, we're, we're going to get Palpatine by default. My young Jedi, you will find that it is you who are mistaken about a great many things. And then we're going to go ahead and flip the crystal over and we're going to activate it once more. Okay, well that one didn't register, so let's uh... There we go. And as you can see, the Sith Holocron has now a white lighting to it. Actually, it looks really good in white. So as you can see, you have Palpatine no matter what color, unless if it's red, then you're going to have some differences. All right, next up, we're going to have this to the side because we're going to come back to this. I'm going to add something extra just in case you've never seen it before. Now we're going to go ahead and bring on over our Jedi Holocron. And we are going to go ahead and start with the white side. Cheers activate this because this takes a, a few seconds to kind of boot up there we go got a nice glow there and this one should be because out of the white crystals there's only two there's ahsoka and there's the blind guy. I would really hope for Ahsoka, but I also like the blind guy from Rogue One. I think his name is Chirrut. Chirrut. Hopefully I'm pronouncing it correctly. The Force is with me. Okay, so it is the blind guy. I'm one with the Force. The Force is with me. We're going to just go play all what the dialogue. What do you know about Crystals? The strongest stars have hearts of Kyber. I'm one with the Force. The Force is with me. The force is with me. May the force of others be with you. What do you know about Kyber crystals? The strongest stars have hearts of Kyber. I'm one with the force. The force is with me. I'm one with the force. The force is with me. So, you know, he says that a lot. I really like the line. I was really sad with uh, what happened to him in the, the movie. He's one of my favorite characters. Where is the door? <laughs> I just lost the door. Oh, it was right in front of my face. All right, now I do know what the green one is. Uh, let me turn this off for a second. Now on the green side, we are going to get Yoda, not just the regular Yoda, we are going to get the eight ball Yoda. Now I know I'm gonna get this comment or this question a lot is, what do you mean eight ball? What does eight ball mean? Put it simply, have you not heard of a magic eight ball? Maybe seen a magic eight ball, maybe had one as a childhood, maybe you know of a friend that had one. That little thing where you basically ask a question and you shake it to see what kind of answers you are going to get. That's basically what I mean by eight ball Yoda. There's also a eight ball Darth Vader, which hopefully will end up in one of the other crystals that still have yet to come. So activate this again, because we're gonna ask Master Yoda some questions. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen, with the dark shadow of the Empire rising to take their place. Okay, I was accidentally holding the sides. By default for the Jedi Holocron with no crystal, you get Obi-Wan warning the Jedi to stay away from the temple. So there's a little extra there, it's not what I meant to do. So putting green down. All right, so because this is the eight ball one, we have to ask Yoda a question to see. So question one, this is the important one. Master Yoda, will Disneyland be open by next month? A certainty this is. Oh, 
Hey, Master Yoda says that Disney will be open by next month. I can't wait. I hope to see you guys then. Um, see, another question. Master Yoda, will I ever become a Jedi Master? <clears throat> Always in motion is the future. That is true. Hey, Master Yoda, will my YouTube channel reach 100,000 subscribers before the end of this year? Keep your mind on where you are, hmm? On what you are doing. I'm sorry, that was just too perfect of a response. I really like the 8-Ball Yoda. I can't go wrong with that. Um, let's see, let's do another question. Uh, so Disneyland Channel Master, um, let's see. Um, Master Yoda, what are the chances of another custom Kyber Crystal being available by next week? <laughs> no. Well, there you have it. <laughs> Oh, that's, that's just too perfect. So take that out. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is that I want to give you guys just one little extra thing with the holocron here. This actually does not use any crystals. It doesn't really matter if you even have crystals. But typically, if you've never seen this, you're just kind of in for a treat. If you have both a Jedi and Sith holocron, and you have them activated, you could stack these on top of each other to get an extra character. And I feel like this one would probably fit with the elemental nature here. Oop. We're too close, man. Too much power. Bring this forward. Holocrons have joined forces, so let's go ahead and activate the secret. Jedi and Sith wield the Ashlar and Bogan, the light and the dark. I'm the one in the middle, the Bendu. Yeah, you get the bindu. I take no side. I am beyond your worrying and wars. I am unseen, unknowable, like a rock in the river. If two such powerful sources of knowledge are united, they will grant a clarity of vision beyond your kind. When joined, any secret, wisdom, or destiny can be seen through the Force. One could bring much chaos with such hidden truths. Let's see. Your conflict becomes clear. I am helping you. You believe that, but you must learn to see things differently now. But I can teach you to see, if you're willing. We'll do one more. The temptation of power, forbidden knowledge, even the desire to do good can lead some down that path. But only you can change yourself. Can I remove these away? Let's go ahead and close these up. So yeah, if you've never seen the holocrons put together, you get the Bindu. But yeah, the Elemental Nature Kyber Crystal. I think this is a great crystal. I mean, I've enjoyed the set thus far, and honestly, I'm really looking forward to completing the entire collection because, you know, ever since I've completed all the Disney ones, I've been looking for, like, another purpose. And, you know, these particular custom crystals, I mean, I know there's going to be a lot of people in the community making custom crystals, um, but these particular ones are definitely one of my personal favorites out there. And uh, like I said, if you guys are interested in these, there's a link in the video description. Once again, there is a link in the video description. It's the first link, you can't miss it, that's going to take you to the website where you can get the crystal. Keep in mind that the Skywalker crystal, the Dark Side crystal, and the Ben Solo one that was available for pre-order not too long ago are completely sold out. Those are limited editions, meaning that since they're sold out, they're not coming back. But the Elemental Nature here is not a limited edition and the other crystals to come out soon after. So again, if you wanna get one, the link is down below. I am not affiliated with them at all. Just keep in mind that it's a small amount of people that are producing and getting these out to you guys. I think it's like two or three people. So if the process seems a little bit slow, Again, there's only a handful of people doing this, 
But until the next time, if you guys have any questions, please let me know in the comment section down below. And I'll see you guys on the next video upload, which will be the Darth Revan lightsaber review. Until then, you guys enjoy the rest of your weekend.